Salute a tutti! It's another beautiful day in Abruzzo. Oh, it is. It's mid June and it's really hot. And um, today we're in Atri, a city in the Taranto province with about 13,000 inhabitants. Beautiful, beautiful views across to the sea and Gran Sasso, ideally located. And we are in the Piazza Duomo uh, with the Duomo, with the dome, the the cathedral um, behind us, which we're going to visit as well. Um, just have a look at this great piazza. There's a lot going on today. There's a lot of weddings and, and uh, other things. There's been a few funerals. There's been a few funerals. Yeah. But you can see it's very busy and um, lively. And across over there is um, a theatre. Let's have a quick peek. Yeah, I think Come we on, will. Let's, let's, go Hang on, let's a quick just peek. film it first. Well, we got we got lucky, didn't we? We got really lucky with the lovely lady in the um, theatre. She let us have a peek in for two minutes, and um, yeah, wow, it's just beautiful, stunning. Three hundred seats, built in eighteen eighty one. Everything's still original. original. Everything. Yeah, yeah. it's just it's even been... the chandelier behind us in the entrance, Murano chandelier, yeah. original, uh, just stunning, and um, uh, a lot of red velvet. Yeah, love so it, love, yeah. love it. I think we should pop to the dome now okay. um, and hopefully all weddings and funerals have been done and dusted. So um, we're inside the dome now which is dedicated to the Virgin Mary. It's called Santa Maria Assunta. Um, it was built in the 13th century over some early Roman baths and I've read that you can still see some of the mosaics of the um, baths wow. through a glass panel. But also, um, it has about 40 frescoes from the 15th century. Like the ones behind us now. Yeah, yeah. And they're from the Abrazzese painter, um, Andrea, Andrew, Andrea Delizio. And what I quite like here is the fact that it hasn't been baroquified. It hasn't, has it? No. Not at all. I wonder what's in here. So this is connected to the dome.
So this little uh, city of Atri um, is very beautifully situated on a, a quite a high hilltop. It's um, 442 okay. metres above okay. altitude. Not that high. Though. So it's not that high, darling. It, but yes, but it does yeah. feel high. Yeah, that's yeah, the thing. Because yeah, yeah. uh, of the views. Yeah. The views it makes you think you're really high up. I don't know if you can see because um, we've got a very well, not, a well, wide lens on, but the sea, you can see the sea very easily there even on a, a slightly hazy day today, like today. Behind us this way, yeah. over there, you must be able to just, if we come this way a little bit, you can just make out the Grand Sasso National Park and mountains there. And I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to see all those furrows. Those are the Kalanki, and we're gonna visit those. So uh, here we are in Atri, or just outside of Atri. We've come to the nature reserve, the Kalanki Nature Reserve, and uh, we're at the visitor centre with the guys who run it, Adriana. Adrian. Elio. <laughs> <laughs> and the visitor centre, which is uh, behind us here. They sent us on a little walk. We're just going to do a little walk because they did sort of mention oh. that we're here in the like and heat also, of the day. And <laughs> also, Pranzo is very yeah. soon, so we have a small but amount of time. We're going to quick march down there now. See. Okay, let's go. So um, we've just left the visitor centre and only come a few minutes, and we're already like astounded by the views here. I don't know if you can already see them behind us. Already in awe of that. It's like a lunar landscape. It's quite spectacular. But. Adriano told me that when we get to that point over there... We'll have an even better view. Mm. But anyway, we'll just give you a little bit of that view now, without us in it. I'd like to cycle down. I wouldn't like to cycle back up this. Sense. I wouldn't Killer. cycle up, no. I'd ask for a lift. Killer. So the Kalanki of Atri, also known as the Badlands of Atri, are an erosive geological formation caused by water and um, it's typical of the Mediterranean climate. The erosion has happened over centuries and centuries and is mainly due to the fact it's a, a mainly a clay ground. Oh, it's so hot. I've had to put my hair up. And, uh, We've had to drink some water. Yeah. Um, we've finally made it to the incredibly large chapel of the Rock of San Paolo and uh, we'll just show you what it is all about. And uh, oh, there he is. And there you go. It's probably the smallest chapel I've ever been in in Abruzzo. But it's a holy rock. Look, I mean literally it has a hole in it. Yeah, Something happens in that hole, we're not quite sure what, um, but obviously some miracle was performed here and probably everyone puts their hand in there, which is why it's so white and worn down inside. What did it feel like? I feel cleansed. Do you? And that's not just the water going through yeah. me, no. And the I sweat. feel like a new woman. Oh, do you feel like a new man? <laughs> Won't mind. It's nice, isn't it? <laughs> you are. Watch the fence, it's electric. And we started up uh, there. Yeah, and we're going to head back up. And we're going to head very slowly Hello, uphill made a little friend on the in way. the Look, hottest yeah. point of the day. My new friend. Only. My <laughs> only friend. Well, he's a little bit like that sometimes, isn't it? Oh, that's good. They're on the way up, which hey. is good. There's a nice breeze. Yeah. Um, and we've got a little friend who's coming with us the whole way. So we've uh, decided to do 
uh, the thing we do, love doing the most, which is uh, popping somewhere for lunch. Yeah. Uh, we're in the centre of Atri in, I've forgotten the name of the restaurant. Osteria Zetti. Osteria Zetti. And we're just going to have a, a light lunch, a little snack, and maybe we'll have a little glass of wine. You never know. I'm sure we will. I'm sure we will. <laughs> uh, so we're just uh, starting a little um, tasting cheese board. And, uh, and we've now got uh, cacciaova. Which is balls of bread, cheese and egg. With balls, a balls of loveliness. And I've got um, uh, gnocchi with uh, cinghiali ragu. There's just one thing missing. Can you guess what it is? Mm, it's coming, don't worry. <laughs> no, Vino has arrived. Can I, can I just say, I've just um, tasted these and, <laughs> the, uh, right, okay, no innuendo implied at all, Andrew, before you say anything, that those are, are the, the best, tastiest. they are the tastiest balls I've, I've can I ever have a, had. Can I have a taste, just a little bit? You of can. One. I'm just going to taste some of my gnocchi with the uh, ragu of cingali. Mmm. Mm. Oh, that's lovely. Cheers. Hello, So we're outside the Palazzo Ducale d'Acquaviva, which was built in the 14th century and now houses the Atri Town Hall, Comune. It's so a very beautiful building. It is. I just wonder if we can have a little peek inside. I'm sure Shall we? Can. we? Yeah. It's a nice space out here. They could make more of the space, the garden. You know me, I put a swimming pool in. Um, but a communal swimming pool. Imagine. Look. I think the issue is that you might just be in the Centro Storico here. And in the Centro Storico, slapping this great big Olympic sized swimming pool at the back of the Palazzo Ducal might not be thought of very well. <laughs> okay, didn't think of that. So we've uh, done our day here in Atri and it's coming to an end and we thought we'd get it by some souvenirs. Yeah, definitely. So um, Atri is really well known for local produce like uh, it's pecorino that like we had for lunch, some really special Fantastic pecorino. Um, Pan de Cale, which is sort of an almond I don't know if you can see it there, sweet. Pan de Cale. You can get that nearly everywhere in a group. That was chocolate. I thought it was just almond. Anyway, we can find There's out. Two different ones. And yeah, and it's really well known for licorice. And actually, whilst we've been living in the group, so I've had licorice um, liqueur. I've never bought any, but um, I might actually come out of the shop with some. <laughs> Buonasera. Buonasera. Wow. Yeah. This is Luigi. Ciao, Luigi. Ciao, Luigi. This is Ciao. his shop. Uh, Bellissima. Yeah. Bellissima, eh, sì, 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 molto prodotti sì. licorizia. Sì. Licorizia è un licorizia prodotto locale. È sì. locale. Antica fabbrica del 1836. Wow, wow. Sì. Anziane, sì. A speciality of uh, Atri. Tipica di Atri, ah, sì. sì. E... Anche il panducale. Panducale. E eh, dimmi, panducale è mandorle o... Mandorle oh. macinate? Sono tutte le, le ste, lo stesso? Sì, sì okay. questo è il classico. Ma c'è anche farcito. Farcito con cioccolato. Con cioccolato. Il classico. Ok, sì, no, eh, prendiamo un classico. Ci sta questo o più grande? Quello è mezzo chilo o 300 grammi. E con licorizia. Um, Ho provato qui in Abruzzo il sì. liquore. Liquore? Sì. sì. Ma sono tante... Tante ditte, ognuno wow. ha la sua ricetta. 
Ok, wow, ma sono tutte fatte ad altri. La, li la liquirizia è tutta di altri. Poi la ditta è chi di Pescara, chi di Chieti, ah. chi di Lanciano. Ok. Ah. Sono le ditte. Però la liquirizia ah. la prendono da qui. E, è fatto, liquirizia è fatta con ehm, eh, la radice de della pianta. Come... Sì, guardi. Si fa con questa, questa è la liquirizia pura, wow, diluita. Okay. E si, cosa fai con questa? Si aggiunge alcol, ah. acqua e zucchero. Ah, oh, ok. You can make your own, you can oh, make you your make own ah, liquor. Okay. Wow. Con questa qua wow. ci si fa due litri e mezzo di liquore. Ok. Wow. Oh okay. wow, that's good to know. Mm. Mm. Okay. Si può anche fare con la polvere di liquirizia. Uh -huh. okay. La polvere si può usare anche in cucina. Ah, per cucinare, okay. fare i risotti, sì. ah, per i dolci, sì, è sì. anche buono. Okay. E ci si può fare anche il liquore. Okay. Questo è proprio di altri. Ah, ok, prendo questo. Questo è buono. Sì, ok. Sì. okay. Sì. Più concentrato. Ok. E per i nostri figli qualcosa di caramelle. Sì, um... può prendere queste, queste. No, no. Che? Okay. Pasta? Pasta, sì. Yeah. Wow, that's okay. a good pasta. Sì. Sì. Grazie ah, mille. Grazie a voi. Okay. Ciao. Buonasera, ciao. ciao. Buonasera, ciao. Grazie. And, and cheers, cheers to, to peace. And cheers to Atti. And to Atti.